A man walks on his farm the morning after a thunderstorm. He sees broken headstones pushing through the earth. He rubs the mud off and sees the inscriptions like hieroglyphics reveal names, dates, ancestry, a cemetery in a field of corn. The local museum set is an old Negro cemetery. And all over, Negro cemeteries are surfacing, appearing in potato fields, appearing in wheat fields, appearing in fields of corn. Like Osiris, they rise from the earth in green resurrection. African skeletons shake the dust from their bones. Skulls with rattling teeth recite litanies of ancient woes. Tongues pout where none existed before and speak in funerary language, griots rise from their graves and recount the stories of their journeys. Hafiz tongues on cleave and recite the surahs of the dawn. Babalaos emerge from the storm and divine with their shells and stones. I see the drummers, them a come, them a run, them a come, them a play the talking drum, the bata drum, the long drum, the funde, the kete, send in electric messages across this land to St. Louvier to rise from his dungeon tomb and prophesy blood and fire. And he says, if a fire make it burn and if a blood make it run. And a woman named Dorinda sits on her tomb, a pipe clenched between her teeth, smoke curling from her lips as she recites and recites and recites the stories of her many passages, the stories of her many, 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 many transformations and all over in Halifax, in Havana, in Montego, in Rio, in Edmonton, in Kingston, in Kingstown. They say, give us strength, give us strength. And we say, rise up fallen fighters, rise up fallen fighters, rise up fallen fighters, rise up, 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 